Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I still don't have an intro, so yes, hi, this is the intro. How are ya? You guys, we are in the thick of Christmas decor, and I thought it would be really fun to try something new this year on our fireplace mantle in our front living room. I really wanted to do like an art installation. Usually I just do like the garland and lights and like little baby owls and little picks and a bunch of different things. It always looks really great, but I want to try something new this year with plastic ornaments. So I went to Michael's, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, and a few other stores and got a bunch of plastic ornaments. I think I spent like $60, all in metallics, because that is the theme of this year's room. It is metallic fantasy, all that glitters is gold, just all silver gold, rose gold peach gold, everything in between. Um, but I have a special guest today that flew into town because she's here for work and she's gonna be helping me. Say hello to... Hi guys and girlies! <laughs> you guys, Hope is here. For the ball haul. Yeah, she's oh. here from, oh. <laughs> that was terrifying. Oh, maybe don't come close don't to the camera. <laughs> but let me show you what's going on. My assistant Storm is here with us. Okay, so this is the before. My idea here is that we'll have cascading ornaments just flowing down either side and the top. It's probably gonna screw up the paint on this if we glue to the top, so I'm gonna try not to because I don't wanna ruin the mantle and have to repaint it. Hope's glue gun is red and mine is blue, and these are the ornaments we're working with. So, as you can see, this is the color palette. Beautiful rose gold, little peaches, regular gold, there's silver, white, this pretty like rose pink, and then you, we're gonna put you on there as well. And then I have this whole thing, there's some white, more silvers, more gold, a lot of glittery. And yeah, so this was about 60 to $70 worth. Some big ones right here. All right, let's get to work, shall we? Let's twerk. Let's twerk. Also, the tree is not done yet, that is next. All right, let's twerk. Sway. Betty. Okay guys, this is where we're at right now. It's looking a little rose goldy on your side, sweetie. I prefer. <laughs> and my side's more like mixed. Uh, but it looks really, really good. We only hot glued a couple to the top. Well. <laughs> and this well. anemone over here. But whatever, hopefully it doesn't destroy it. We'll see. But look at it all the way from back here. It looks so pretty. I just wanted to have more volume, I think, going down. I think that's what we need. Okay, she is coming together. She's bulbous, we're still building this down. And same on this side. Um, I got these picks, but they're giving it too much of a pink flare, and that's what I did last year. Um, so I might either like spray them gold or try to find some gold ones. Um, but those were gonna kinda go all around. We don't know, yeah. It's coming together, right, girly? Yeah, girly. We have our coffees, and we're twerking away. This is very important, guys. Oh god, this is the most annoying part. <laughs> oh my god! No! Bulb! Oh, go into the silver. <laughs> this is what I've been seeing all day while I'm hot glue guy. It's so shocking. Hi, how are ya? Hey, dummy. Now your side is too silvery. <laughs> put some rose gold. Look, she said, I literally said, put more silver. She puts only all silver. silver. I have a balance issue. <laughs> yeah. Imbalanced. <laughs> no, no, not that one. Use these ones because this gives you more of the actual rose color. Do my nose. Ooh. All right, everyone. It's a little later. Hope is gone. I've got my little New York accent going on. We have a problem. This looks absolutely stunning. Stunning, okay? Take a look, my studio audience. Take a look. Oh my goodness. Look how perfect it looks. Mind you, the wreath is not up, the foy is not on, the tree isn't decorated, but look how stunning it is. My problem is here, folks. 
that it's too perfect. We need some waves. We need some dimension. We need some va va boom. So I went to Michael's and I got some more ornaments. These are all 50% off, which I'm happy about. And I got some more larger ones, which I think will build it up a little more. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna build it up a little bit here and get some waves going on. Build it up over here and get some waves. Maybe put a big one over here. Maybe put some trickling down the front just to give it that extra mm and really take it there. I hope you guys are excited because we have hit that level in the night when I'm a little crazy. Let's do this. All right, are you guys ready for the big reveal? Joey came down, we did a little talking, and he talked me into taking a little bit out and giving it a little more shape. I added some bigger styles like I showed you before, and it looks so good, oh my God. Bam, look at that dimension, you guys. How it has like the little rounded corners, and then here it's like a little peak and rounded there. It looks so stunning. I added these bigger ones right here, and then I added some more over here just to give it that cascading feeling. It's so beautiful, it truly looks like an art piece. I'm so proud of it. I can't wait to see how it ties in. So up here, the wreath, uh, Aretha, Aretha, Aretha Franklin is going up there. I need to fluff this. It's gonna have like a design in it like last year. And then as you can see, I put 200 strands of mini lights tucked behind it to give it that like glow. Look, I'll show you what it looks like when I turn off the lights, hold on. Look how beautiful that is. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. It's getting there, it's getting there. So far it has been, I think working on this probably cumulatively eight hours, which is a lot. I'm tired, I'm gonna keep going. I'm working on this wreath and I'll show you guys a little update in a bit. It's one in the morning and I need to go to bed. This is where I got with everything. The lights are off so you can get, feel the full fantasy. Ready? <sighs> Bam. Oh my goodness, let me try to come in here. Wow. Oh my God, I'm honestly so shook and so proud of myself. The detail. Wait, let me get a flash in here, hold on. Love it, guys, oh my god. So excited. So I put lights behind it, it's all shimmery and gorge. And then up here, it's the wreath's not done yet, but I put silver and gold ornaments, and then some of these gold sticks, and some of these little silver thingies right there. And I just pop those in there. And then all the ornaments are, I use the green like florist wire to put those in. Yes, she's looking gorgeous. All right, so I am gonna go to bed. I will see you guys in the morning. We're gonna start working on the tree. <sighs> I'm tired, good night. All right, so it's the next day and I'm trying to get these little trees, these little glitter, they're like gold and cream and then those ones are rose gold. I used them last year on top of the fireplace. But this year I'm gonna put them way up top here just cause this whole area is a little dead and boring. So here's this ladder. We're about going like 14 feet up. This tree's 16, 15 or 16. So here we go. Okay, that looks so good. It just ties in with all the colors here. Gives it that little oomph. Let me take it back and show you. Wow. Hey guys, it is the next day and we're back. Hi Hope. Hey Gary. I've had her sitting there for like a half an hour. It's like... been one hour and 45 minutes actually. <laughs> I had to post a picture, okay. So we are on the final stages of the front living room. Right now we are about to do the tree. Are you excited, sweetie? I am, yeah. You already broke one of my ornaments. You did No, you did it. <laughs> you did it. Okay, let me show you some of the ornaments that we're gonna be putting on. Again, we're trying to go with the gold, silver theme. A little bit of less rose gold because I did rose gold last year, so we're trying to do something a little different, but it's basically gonna coordinate with the fireplace I think you can see the fireplace is still intact For the most part um, Here are some of the ornaments from well, I use these every year, but because every year we kind of do a goldish theme beautiful Oh the pretty pretty yes, how beautiful these little deer are these are from West Elm I love them. You guys saw these in the close-up that I did. Come on, focus. You focus. Focus. Beautiful. 
buck. And what do we have here? You know the vibes. You know the vibes. We have more gold. These are from TJ Maxx and Marshalls. These are from Michaels and they are 50% off, so it's $5. These are from West Elm. These are from Michaels, 50% off. Um, then I have some iridescent globules here. Bobbles. Bobbles. Oh, bubble tear. Pretty? Where are these from? Um, these are from Anthropology, oh. and these are from Balsam Hill, which are really pretty. These are from Marshalls. These are from Marshalls. These are from Anthropology. These little diamonds are from a boutique called, what is it, Mark's Garden or something in Long Beach, so pretty. I don't think I'm gonna be using these this year, but these are from Pier 1 Imports. All right, let's get started, sweetie. Sweaty. Sweaty. Hope, first things first, I need you to get up on that ladder and put on the star. Absolutely not. <laughs> All right, let's time lapse, shall we? Yes. yes. We're at a standstill with the Christmas tree and I don't want to show you the final product without it being done. Um, it still needs something, it's missing something. It looks way too similar to last year. So I'm gonna wait a little bit, check online, see what I can find to make it really pop. But in the meantime, we are in the kitchen right now and we are, so you guys, I don't know if you saw my video last year, but I have a bunch of little homes, little townhouses, condominiums, mansions, etc. that are a small winter wonderland town. City? Town? Little snow town? So this year I wanted to do it down the strip of the island because we tend to put a lot of stuff on our kitchen island and I hate it. So I think this will deter us from doing so. So let's go take a look at what we have. Here are my gorgeous homes. Multiple homes. Sorry, you've been cast out. Your house been sold. You forgot to pay your mortgage. This little, this wooden one is yours. Yes. For closure, for sale. <gasps> for you. Thank you, Santa. We also have some trees. These ones are from World Market. These guys are from World Market as well. These are from Michaels. These big pines are from TJ Maxx. World Market. Uh, World Market and World Market. And these homes are from Michaels a few years ago. And World Market. <laughs> and World Market. Uh, and these guys are from World Market. World Market. <laughs> okay, we also have some snowflakes um, from Target. That was two dollars. And then these sparkly uh, snowflakes. Uh, these are from Michaels. They're four dollars. She loves it when I go in and I out of my do. accent. Um, and then we have some of these uh, gorgeous Christmas LED dew drops. Why doesn't this one have a pair? I know, it was the last one. That's gonna bother you. I know this I know. is gonna come to me in a box because it bothered you too much. <laughs> Sold it. Now presenting Miss Christmas. <gasps> oh my goodness. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> gorgeous. This is a little faux fur rug moment. Oh. Reveal fully clothed underneath. Full we'll reveal. Is that stuff? Gorgeous. Enough? We love faux. Vegan. <gasps> You'll be next. Yeah. You'll be next, little fox. Everyone is a little bit later. Um, I'm back in the car. To be honest with you guys, I am not feeling inspired this Christmas. I am for our other living room, but the front living room that I've been working on in this video. The fireplace is amazing, I love it, but the tree is just lacking for me. It's decorated, just looks the same as like a few years ago. There's nothing really special, it doesn't make me feel anything. So I'm heading down to my favorite place uh, near Long Beach. It's an hour, it's like an hour from LA. Um, it's called Rogers Gardens. Uh, they're a beautiful landscaping company and they have the most incredible Christmas decorations and installations and everything. And I always get a lot of inspiration from them and I want to go and see it in person, maybe pick up some stuff. It's Friday, so there's a little bit of traffic. It's, um, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see when we get there, but hopefully I can find something that makes me uh, excited about this tree. I don't know. I'm just like looking at it, it's kind of like meh. 
Meh. Meh. All right, you guys, we are here. Oh my goodness. Look how magical everything looks. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with this tree. How gorgeous. So cute, look, it's literally Wolf and Storm. Oh my god. Wait, I feel like I need these. <gasps> is this Lark? Kind of. Kind of, but not quite. This is more like Lark. She's a little too dark. <gasps> oh my gosh, $40, I don't think so. Gorgeous though. I'm kind of striking out in the inspiration ornament pop of color need that I traveled an hour and 15 minutes for. But I'm gonna go take another look and I'm gonna see if anything just jumps out and snatches my wig right off my head. Hopefully it does because I need a little inspo right now. Okay, I picked up these two homes with lights inside. They're so gorgeous. I love the pastel vibe. And I'm also really inspired by this mint kind of sea foam moment going on here. So I'm gonna to try to find some ornaments that work in that kind of color palette. This is cute for now. Oh, I also got these picks for the tree, like these gold pine cones. All right guys, it's a little bit later. Um, I am on my way home, but I just stumbled across a place and I'm really excited about it. So my friend Nicole Concilio uh, told me about this place called All Dicks. All Dicks, we've seen all the dicks. It's called Aldix, and I believe it's Christmas on crack, so let's go take a look. Oh my god. What have I been missing my whole life? <gasps> Stunning. Wow. I'm not sure what she would do. Oh my god. You guys? Oh my god. You guys? This place puts that other place yeah, that's all. on the back burner. This is absolutely shocking. I'm in my element right now. Guys, I'm truly speechless. This is literally the best store I've ever been to. This is so insane. This is just the tree section alone. What have I been missing my entire life? Oh my god, you guys, I could cry right now. You have no idea. This is the most beautiful place I've ever been my entire life. I am very overwhelmed. Earlier I thought I liked this sea foam color, but I don't. I actually really like, where is it? It's over here, let me show you. I like this wine color. I think it is so pretty. These are so stunning. With the gold, it looks so gorgeous. These ornaments, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, how stunning. <gasps> Fancy seeing you here. Look who dragged me out of the house. Look who dragged you out of the it's a house. Rare occurrence, but this is truly Christmas, shocking. I'm like an it's a Christmas miracle. So we are taking info from this. This is gonna be our color. We have some of these guys, some of the dark, darker ones. Joey likes these weird pomegranate things. So They're we're getting gorgeous. some of those, some of the gold ones, some of these branches. And I think this is really gonna take our tree there. Yeah, fine. Since you're not happy with it. Very disappointed in you this year. Oh, this angle. I'm is also really, really sad that the house isn't fully decorated. You've really slacked this year, just saying. Well, I'm giving you the best angle because you're being nasty. Actually, I don't have any bad angles, so go ahead. Okay. I look good. Pretty. Pretty. <laughs> you guys, I know it doesn't look like anything, but look how majestic this is. Oh my god, just give a little shake. <gasps> Can you see the sparkles on camera? I don't know. I don't think you can, but it is so pretty. It's like an art piece. All right guys, it's a little later and I am home now. I'm gonna get to decorating, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, I have videos going up, obviously today, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday is the grand finale with the house tour. So make sure you have my notifications on. You've liked this video, subscribe, left a comment down below, and I will see you guys tomorrow. I still don't have an outro, so this is the outro. Okay, bye.